gentlemen, welcome to the video. We're going to be looking at Tots Ben Yedder today. Ben Yedder, Warwick card with a five star skills, a four star week for ladies and gentlemen. This card looks truly unbelievable. Now, I bought him, I actually sniped him for 2,170,000 coins and I was gassed about that. I don't know what happened to the market, it just went up and uh, then it sort of goes down like Sunday. I don't know what happened when I bought him. I think I bought him on a Wednesday and the market just trickled up, 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 up on Thursday. I don't know what's going on. However, he went up. We're also going to be looking at Amin Gwedi. I think that's his name. He's got a five-star skills, a four-star week. I used him in strike with a five-star skills. I love a five-star skiller. And also a particular uh, attention to Dante. Now, Dante, centre-back. This guy was really easy to do, henceforth. I had a League One team and I just thought, right, why not? And I'll give this guy a shot. I did him in virtually about, I think it took me about 30 minutes to do him. It took me, it just, it was so easy to get him. He's a fantastic centre back. Honestly, so dominant, so strong with the 99 strength, quick. He's nasty. I love this centre back to bits. He's really good at intercepting. He's got good height. He's got perfect work rates for a centre back. I think this is a must do. If you're running a Brazilian team, if you're running a League One team, I think why not go for this amazing centre back? But yeah, the star, the star of the weekend. Yeah, Ben Yedder, what can I say about this guy? Now, I want to actually talk about some of Ben Yedder's weaknesses before we get started with this card. He's quite weak. Yeah, that's uh, one of his uh, negatives or what can we see, disadvantages about the card. He's quite relatively weak. He's not very tall, so he doesn't really win any headers. Uh, he can win headers, don't get me wrong, but it's not going to be a common occurrence. It's not going to be something that happens constantly. He's not like a Cristiano Ronaldo or something along them lines. So these are two things that I think are paramount in a striker position. Good heading. I think a lot of people cross the ball in. And also being a strong is kind of a prerequisite of a great striker. But listen, that's the only thing holding this card back. Besides that, it's all positives. Amazing agility and balance. Amazing shooting. He's got the five-star weak foot. This guy can turn a game on a dime. He's quick. He's got amazing passing. He's got amazing shooting on either foot. What, a, what an unbelievable card. And I think what a good thing to do was pairing this guy up with Amin Guiri. That Amin Guiri has got five-star skills. He just, you know, he's got that little bit of sauce. I think sometimes you're coming up against some defensive lines that you just think you can't crack with four-star skills. I think a five-star skiller does the job and that's why I always will have one five-star skiller up forward. 100% it's just the way I play. But listen, both of them. I think Amin Guiri is uh, only 87. He was only 87 rated squad. I think he's fantastic value for coins. I really, really like that card. I really admire that card. I think, yeah, definitely, definitely, for me anyway, the guy I'd go for. For 87 rated squad, that's no problem. That he was, he was getting the ball in the back of the net. He was, he was fantastic. Now Ben Yedder, what can I say about Ben Yedder? This guy, honestly, he was a one-man army at times. There was times I was like two 0 down, and this guy would just come out nowhere, score four goals, and the guy's gone. What a card! Now, do I think he's worth the 2.2 million coins or 2.17? I think 2 million 170 thousand coins. I do think he's worth that. I think he's really, really good. The only reason why I would say he's good value, not excellent value for coins, he's not W Savio. He's not W Savio base, no chance. And quite frankly, he's definitely not double Suarez. I mean, Suarez, team of the season, I bought him for a million coins. He was brilliant, like brilliant. So I'm not going to sit here and tell you for Benny Edwards worth the 2.2 million coins. I think he's good value because of what he did for me on the weekend. He was fantastic. But I just think there's some fantastic, fantastic alternatives out there. I mean, Eusebio's four star, five star as well. And bear that in mind, he's quick. He's got amazing shooting. Fair enough, he's not got as good passing as this Benny Edwards. But let me tell you, he's right up there. As uh, He's right up there. He's definitely better uh, value for coins. Because there's no way Ben Yedder's W Sabio. And can I just say, Luis Suarez has definitely got things that I would love that he, he's got that are way better than Ben Yedder. Like he's way better in heading than Ben Yedder. He's way stronger than Ben Yedder. Okay, so you've got to put this in mind. Ben Yedder's got five star weak foot. That Suarez has got a five star weak foot as well. So this card, even though I love him to bits and I will say he's worth it, I'm not going to tell you, oh wow, he's amazing value for coins, but he's not. He's not. You know what I mean? It's like um, this watch. He's worth whatever, like 200 quid. 
All right? I think that's good value, but I'm sure out there, there might be better value out there. And I'll just tell you right now, I've used the likes of Eusebio. I've used the likes of Base Cruyff. I've used the, the, the likes of the great, great striker that is Luis Suarez. And I can say it right now that this Ben Yedder has not doubled them. Okay, he's not doubled them. So, yeah, but overall, I massively enjoyed the weekend league playing with his League One team this season. I think right now, I'll tell you guys right now, people that were quite disappointed. I, I didn't think that Guendouzi was that good. I think Fofana's good, but he's a limited going forward. Okay, I will just say that Saliba and also there's another guy, Tolibo. Is it Todi Todibo? Sorry, Todibo. He's really good for their price. They're both really, really worth it, the centre backs. Todibo, that's his name. He's really worth it. But yeah, Dante, 100% I'd go for Dante. Absolute bull. Did a stellar job for me at the back to, uh, this weekend league. I love that card to bits. Left back Mendes, can't go wrong with that card. I thought he was flawless. Honestly, he did everything that I wanted him to do. He was brilliant. Absolutely sensational. And yeah, that's all I'm going to say. I mean, Guiri was fantastic. I feel like, yeah. I think if I were to play again, I would 100% get the best player in League One. I would love to get like an Mbappe or a Paqueta. These guys are like the real gems in League One. But anyway, thank you very much for watching. Thank you. Peace out.